stardom as stands with a fist in the Oscar-winning film Dances with Wolves. Since then, her star has continued to shine in blockbusters like Independence Day and cult favorites like Battlestar Galactica. Yay! These days, you can catch her as a no-nonsense Los Angeles police captain on the TNT hit Major Crimes. Take a look. Did you find him yet? Um, yeah. But unfortunately, he was already murdered. But why? Well, because if you hang out with criminals, you eventually are going to become a witness, a suspect, or a victim. Please welcome two-time Academy Award nominee, Mary McDonald. You just sparkle. Yes. Your yes. eyes oh, dance. Excited. Yes. Yes. We are so excited. Yes. Thank you. Now, Mary, among your many roles yes. um, was your Emmy-nominated turn on ER. Yes. Yes, we loved you on that. Mm -hmm. But help me out here, because before you were on ER with Cloody and Noah Wiley and all those guys, there was another show in 1984 also called ER. It was a yes. comedy, mm -hmm. also, oddly enough, with George Clooney <laughs> that you worked yeah, on. Right. Yes, absolutely. There's, he was yeah. the cutest thing you've ever seen. <laughs> he, I, he, I, he was very young. I think he was 23. And, oh, really? Uh, he was disciplined. You know, he, you could tell that he was a really good actor, but we had no idea <laughs> who he was to become. Right? Isn't that interesting? You, you didn't see it coming? Like, you didn't say, everyone said, oh, this guy's going straight to the top. He's going to be like... Oh, he was cute. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Oh, yes. No, there's no doubt about it. You know what I mean? I mean, you know, there's no predicting, but uh, he was adorable. Yeah. <laughs> I actually oh, wow. I worked with him then, too. You did? Yeah, yeah. but he was prankstery and still something goofy sweet about him. Totally. So I don't think you knew he was going to be this huge movie star. You uh, know? I think that's true. Like, you, you didn't really understand what a powerhouse he was because mm -hmm. he had that trickster kind of energy mm -hmm. and everything. And he's adorable. So, but your career changed when you were, okay, stands what? Yeah. Stands with fists. Okay, how, how was the fist? Was the fist, or was the, the fist? fist no, the fist was. Oh, oh, it was a, oh yeah, I thought she was one I, of them. I, I was like, <laughs> well, you know what? In her heart of hearts, she was one of them. She was one of them. Yeah, okay, definitely. right on, right on. I don't know if they did that then, right. you know, on the prairie, but she had a story about mm -hmm. punching someone who insulted her. Mm -hmm. And that's how she got her Indian name, Stands with Stands with Fizz. She stood up to someone and clocked her. Absolutely. <laughs> so yeah. what was challenging? What was, what was challenging about it? It seemed like it would have been a... A lot of fun to play, but what was challenging about Okay, well, one of the things that was challenging is that at the beginning when we had these uh, rehearsals and we would go out and ride horses as part of our rehearsal process. And I'm sorry, but we were bareback, and who's done that? Not me. Mm -hmm. So we would get on our horses every morning and the guys would gallop away on their horses. And I'd be there holding on to my horse's mane with my trainer going, can we slow down? Oh, my goodness. And so I was renamed Dust in Her Face. <laughs> It because I have my own name. You earn those names. You have to earn a Native American name, and I earn mine. <laughs> As many people who, who loved you from that film, and I remember vividly the day I saw the film, it was extraordinary. Yeah, I can remember film. to this day. Mm -hmm. um, you also have an incredibly passionate fan base from your days on the sci fi cult classic, huge hit, Battlestar Galactica. I know. Yeah. And you played President Laura Roslin. So yeah. what, have, what have been some of your most interesting encounters with fans from that show? Well, I think the one that was most interesting is I was in the airport in Chicago, and I was with my son, who I think was 10 years old. And we were in a hurry. We were trying to make a connection. And, you know, that airport is crazy. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So we're moving very quickly. And I kind of notice up ahead this group of men, and I notice them notice me. And I'm like, oh, no, here we go. What do I do? I don't have anyone with me. My husband's not here. So, so how do I 
say hello or not. So I put my head down, and then right before I got to them, I noticed that they all got in line and, and saluted. Oh. <laughs> because I did play the president of the universe. Oh, that's right. So <laughs> they saluted me, and, and then I, without even thinking about it, I just went, gentlemen. <laughs> and, oh, yeah. feet later, my son, we went around the corner and he stopped me and he said, Mom, this is out of control now. You're responding like your heart. <laughs> <laughs> well, we also want to congratulate you on the second season of Major Crimes. Yeah. And, uh, yeah. You play Captain Sharon Raider, who's sort of by the book style, gets you in trouble with other team members. So does that? Oh, yeah, it was brutal. Yeah, does that? Yeah. But does that fiction cross over with your castmates? Or well, it... actually, no. They were always lovely to me, but when you know, between action and cut, they were so mean. <laughs> and, you know, and it was oh. so hard because it's kind of like, well, all right, let's do this, let's do it. And I knew what my job was. My job was to give them a hard time and to have them not like me. But they were always very nice at the end. And what? So wait, Tom Berger is as joined as your not so quite ex husband, not so right? Quite at all. I mean, Tom Barron. Tom Barron. Yeah. Yeah. Very handsome. Yeah. I know. He's adorable. And we, we worked together in 1989. So it's, it's lovely to be back together again. And he is not. We've been married. My character has been married to his character for, we think, maybe about 30 years. Wow. And we haven't lived together in 10, but we won't divorce. So it gets very complicated. Yes. Yes. Mary McDonnell, everyone. Thank you, Mary. You can see Mary in major crimes every week on TNT. We'll be right back.